Lacrosse is a team sport that can be played either indoors or outdoors where players use a long stick with a net at the end to catch, carry, and throw a small ball while trying to get the ball into the other team's goal. The sport was created nearly a thousand years ago by Native American Indians, specifically the Iroquois, and has since been appreciated as one of the oldest games in North America while continuing to spread globally. Now before I teach you how to play, we must go over the proper equipment needed to stay safe during the cross. A stick. A head. Cleats. A chest pad. Elbow pads. A helmet. And last but not least, a jersey. In order to keep the ball on your stick while running up the field and past defenders, you must cradle the ball up and down. Cradling a lacrosse ball takes lots of practice. For some it might come natural while others it might be a very awkward process. However, the more time and practice you put into it, the better you will get. The three main types of cradling used in lacrosse are at your waist, overhand and one arm. In order for a lacrosse team to maintain possession of the ball, they must pass it back and forth between players with crisp, accurate passes leading towards the target using proper mechanics every time. To pass, begin with your top hand about three quarters up the stick and your bottom hand on the bottom. While you snap your wrist downwards, you are also pushing with your top hand and leading through with your front left foot. Twist your hips and follow through with the pass for stronger and accurate passes. In order to catch, place your top hand near the head of your stick, keeping your bottom hand near the bottom. Place the head of your stick to the right of your face making a square above your shoulder for your target. To catch the ball, use soft hands and bring it back, allowing the ball to sit in your net before you cradle it and keep going down the field. Now that we have the basics of passing and catching down, we can move on to the fun part, shooting. Shooting a lacrosse ball is similar to passing. However, it requires more power and accuracy as well as different release points. For example, there's overhand, sidearm, and underarm. To score a goal, you must first get it past the goalie. And the easiest way to do so is to pick corners, 
or shoot below the goalie's legs in areas where it is harder to reach. Now that I've covered the fundamentals of offense, I will go over some techniques of how to play defense. Proper defensive positioning requires crouching and pointing your stick out towards the offense. To stop the ball from getting past you, you're allowed to throw checks or use your body in order to push the players away. So yeah, there's a few tips and tricks of how to play lacrosse. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful and might even be inspired to go play yourself. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was fun to make. If you have any questions, come ask me. I'd be happy to answer them. If I didn't cover it in this video, I know it was short. But yeah, have a great day, have a great life, and I'll see you guys later.